This video tutorial will show you how to add the necessary toolbars for sleep analysis. You will learn how to select the appropriate scoring type. We'll demonstrate how to mark sleep stages in Native Sleepworks using the review toolbars, the hotkeys, staging a study while playing mode, and how to display the previous 15, current, and next 15 scored epochs in the taskbar. During sleep analysis, you can use the review toolbar, the staging toolbar, and the summary toolbar to score a study. If any of these toolbars are hidden, choose View, go to Toolbars, and select the missing one. From the Review Toolbar, make sure that the Navigation Mode is set to Epoch. Then, make sure that you select the appropriate staging terminology. Go to Edit, select Settings, select Tab Scoring Sets, and select the staging type for instance, the Adult AASM, then click OK. From the Montage Toolbar, select the Time Base. Now, from the Staging Toolbar, pin the Auto Paging option to automatically jump to the next epoch after marking the current epoch. Assign a stage to each epoch using the staging toolbar. Pin the appropriate stage. Let's pretend that this epoch is stage W, so you pin W. Let's pretend that this epoch is in 1, so we pin in 1. Let's pretend that this epoch is in 2, so we press in 2. Let's pretend that this epoch is in 3, so we press in 3. Let's pretend that this epoch is stage R, so we select RAM. You also can assign a stage to each epoch using the keyboard. What you need to do is to hit the correspondent hotkey. 0 for stage W, 1 for stage in 1. 2 for stage in 2, 3 for stage in 3, and 5 for stage R. There is another option for sleep analysis that is called staging a study while playing. The way the stage by play feature is initially applied depends on the navigation mode selected. You can score by epoch, page or unscored epoch. Let's select page. Note that in the case of page mode, the amount of information that makes up a page depends on epoch length and the time base. For instance, if your epoch length is 30 seconds and your paper speed is 30 seconds per page, you will see one epoch per page. And navigating by page and epoch will be the same. However, if your epoch length is 30 seconds and your paper speed is 2 minutes, you will see four epochs per page. And Navigating by page and epoch will be quite different. To enter stage by play mode, double click one of the stage buttons on staging toolbar. The button will become pinned. This indicates the stage will be constantly applied as the study plays forward unless one of the cancelling actions occurs. 
To cancel the stage by play mode, you can click any staging button including the pinned one being clicked again. Or press a keyboard shortcut for one of the staging buttons. Or release the stage by play mode. Or using the right or left arrows. In order to show the sleepy stages of the previous 15 and next 15 ebooks of the ebook you are presently reviewing in the status bar of the review window, go to File, select Customize, select Tab Status Bar, and from the remaining options list, select Staging. Select either insert before or after, then click OK. Then it shows the current ebook, previous 15, and next 15 ebooks as they were scored. This is the end of the video.